In this video, I'm going to show you how this Shopify dropshipping general store went from zero to more than $168,000 per month in just two months selling exclusively dropshipping products. And I'm going to show you a lot of stores just like it so you can replicate the system yourself and get those results as well. Let's find out. Hey, what is up? Like I said, in this video, I'm going to show you a general store dropshipping strategy from zero to more hundred thousand dollars per month. I found multiple stores at this level that went from literally zero. You can see their stats and their traffic and their revenue goes up and up and up to more than hundred thousand dollars per month, selling multiple different general products. They're all general stores so that you can finally understand that general stores are profitable. I've been getting this question a million times. Are general store profitable? Should I start a general store when I'm a beginner? Yes, they are profitable. I'm going to show you the right strategy to do it so you can replicate it as well. But before we start, I'm happy to announce that we will be launching a brand new e-commerce drop shipping program called the Ecom Secret Formula. A lot of people have been mentioning that the mentoring program, the inner circle might be a little bit out of their budget. So this particular program that I'm releasing covers everything about Facebook ads, winning products, Instagram, Google, literally all the secrets that I've been sharing on YouTube, all packed into one exclusive program. You've just seen the tip of the iceberg on YouTube. This is the rest of it, all the strategies, everything that I have for you and packed, packed full of value. That program will be out very, very soon. If you want to join the wait list and receive 50% off the launch price, make sure to check out the first link down in the description, sign up your name and email, and I'll send you an email when we launch with a 50% off link. And as always, I give out one free consulting call in every single video. If you want to win a call directly with me, not with my team, with me for one hour consulting, checking your store, your ads, whatever you want, comment secrets, secrets down in the comments, subscribe, hit that notification bell, hit that like button, and you'll be entered to win. All right, so this is a store that I was talking about. It's called Pashio shop.com and you can see that they have a lot of pretty saturated products a lot of products that a lot of people are selling out there and it's a very general store it just says catalog on the top it is good looking it does look okay but it's not the best best brand and it says right here healthy is wealthy travel added garden outdoor so it's definitely a very 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 general store built with a pretty good theme i mean it looks pretty good it has a lot of products if you want to go ahead and check it out just go to pasho shop Com. They have a lot of products on here. If you go to sales source this application right here and click analyze store We can see that in just two months They created that domain and they went from zero to more than a hundred and sixty eight Thousand dollars per month in revenue right here The theme is called prestige which I think is a pretty cool one and it's 180 bucks in the Shopify theme store It looks pretty good if you have a little bit of money to invest in a theme This is a good one as long uh, along with the turbo and the shop optimized one But this store is absolutely killing it if you look at the best-selling products They have the beard straining comb with there a lot of people have been trying to make this product profitable a lot. I've seen a lot of ads for this product and this particular store is absolutely crushing it with it. I also saw an ad for the little hook that they have. It's a little um, grabbing hook. I'm trying to see if I can find that hook somewhere here. This one right here. So the ad that I found for this particular one is this ad right here. It says stainless steel survival folding gravity hook. The really cool thing about this page that I want to show you and that you should apply to yourself as well is that they use multiple Facebook pages to advertise different products. So they keep they keep different product categories along different Facebook pages. So if you look at this particular video, this is a little hook that they use to grab and you can check it out. It doesn't have that many views. About a week ago it has 262,000 views and if you go to the Bitly link on their ad, you just have to add a plus sign to it to see the traffic and see how much uh, traffic they're getting to the site. So if you click on that, 6,912 links, and yesterday it got 1,600. That means they're pretty much scaling it for 150, 340, 326, and now they're scaling to the thousands, and today is the 24th. They already have 500 link clicks, and in the US right now, it's like 5 a.m. So this is a lot, a lot of traffic. You can see United States and Germany are the top two ones. Facebook and Instagram, obviously they're running a lot of Facebook and Instagram traffic. Very, very interesting. You've got to check out this product right here. Uh, we'll go back 
to the actual ads library for this particular page. It's called Home in Heaven. And this is one of their Facebook pages. This ties into the strategy that I wanna show you. You can use multiple product pages or multiple Facebook pages for the same store. They're using this Home in Heaven to advertise these two products. Right here, they're using the, the pet trimmer. And this one, this Bitly in particular, let, let's see how many it has. We can add a plus sign to it. We'll add a plus sign right here and see how much it actually has. 9,000 and it's been scaling up pretty well, 1,000 per day. And today we're at 188 clicks. Again, as I said, it's 5 a.m. in the morning, United States, Australia, Canada. So it's getting really, really solid traffic for those two lonely ads that they're doing on that page. They also have another page we saw on Salesforce that their top winning product was this beard straightening comb. It was very, very, very hard to find this particular page, but I finally found it. It's called the Gift of Given, and this one in particular has 720 likes with that little ad that we saw right there, this beard straightening comb. The video doesn't actually play, and if we check out the Bitly link on that particular ad, let's click that and put it here. And we'll add a plus sign to that. It has a massive, massive volume of 466,000 clicks. It's absolutely insane. They started this in May 29. They absolutely scaled this product 25,000 a day, 30,000 a day clicks from United States, United Kingdom, Australia, Canada. They were getting crazy sales for this particular product and then it died down. That's kind of the strategy with a general store that you want to focus on. You want to test multiple products, try to find one that you can scale. They probably made about half a million, probably about $300,000 off of this product exclusively. Now they're testing other, other products. That's the strategy for a general store. Now we're creating a store in the German market. We're trying to test a store in Germany. And this is the strategy that we're gonna go with. We're gonna test about eight to 10 products, testing them on Facebook ads, try to find one that we can scale. And again, do the same thing. We scale it as much as possible and then try to find another product. It is kind of a roller coaster, but you can make a solid amount of money with just that one single product. It can make you like half a million dollars and then you pass on to the next product, and then you pass on, and it's kind of dynamic. You don't get bored of having that one single product that you're advertising all the time. So let's go back to the website because I wanna show you the traffic stats. If we click on the similar web, you can see right here, February zero, March zero, May zero, or April zero, May 8.39K, and look at that, June, 282,000 clicks on their site. July is probably like half a million, or even more right there, and it just exploded. United States, our main traffic source. That's what happens a lot with general stores. You'll have one product that just blows up and absolutely crushes. That is exactly what happened to my student right here, Harry. Look at that curve right there. This month of July, he's made $13,000, and look at that curve. Look at that. From nothing, absolute zero, 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 got a few sales, came back up, and now, bam! Absolutely scaling it. This guy is at a hundred orders a day right now, making two thousand to three thousand dollars every single day. And this is usually what happens with students in general stores. They stay like that for a little bit, for a couple of days, maybe a week, two weeks of testing, and then absolutely scaling it. And his profit margin is actually very, very high. It's around 25 to 30 percent. I referred him to my dropshipping agent to scale the heck out of this thing. So he's absolutely crushing it. A lot of students just like that. If you want to learn the strategies that I'm teaching them, I'm gonna put them all in the Ecom formula. Make sure to sign up for the waitlist below. So let's go back to the store right here and I'll show you a few other general stores that are doing exactly the same thing. This is another uh, store called Call Car Flare, Car Flare, and I found it actually today with their particular ad for a emoji, little draw or emoji emoticon that you can draw on your car. One of these ones right here. First voice control emoji card display. You can check it out right there. You can use it for showing that you have a baby. You can show it for maybe you're learning how to drive and you can put that thing of learning to drive or whatever you want, anything funny. Literally, you can use this and it's selling like crazy. This particular store, if we go on sales source and we click analyze store right here, we can see how much money they're making every single month or how much money they're starting to make and you won't believe when this store was started. They started a month ago, a month, a month ago, and they're making 71,000 to 142,000 because they found that one product that they're now scaling to the next 
level. They're scaling this product like crazy. They have multiple ads going for it. And their ad copy is a bit off. Like their ad copy is just full of a bunch of emojis. It's not really very attractive ad copy at all. It's mostly just about the product. When the product is the top top, it beats all other products. A lot of people want that. And really it solves either a problem or it's a very unique and trending thing. Like this doesn't solve any problem. There's no problem to be solved here. There's no really thing that they're fixing. It's more of just, it's a really cool product to have. And people feel that fear of missing out. Once you hit that emotion, people remember people buy based on emotion and then they justify it with logic. They buy out of emotion of, wow, this is so cool. I really, I, I have fear of missing out on this little thing and not having it on my car. Let me buy it. And it's really cool. They're actually selling it for, I'm not really sure the price. We're going to check right now for $99. So it's actually pretty expensive on this thing. They even have, you know, they have the whole shebang, the countdown timer on the top. Really just not the best store out there, but they're absolutely crushing it. They do have reviews on the bottom, but it's not really the best store. And if we go to their page right here, it's run in the, in the US. So they have three people in the United States, one people in Canada, one people in the United Kingdom. Going back to that store that we talked about, which was the uh, Pasho shop. If we go to the ads library, you can see that their pages are run by people in Vietnam. So Vietnam, they have 14 people on this one. And then on this one, they have 16 people. So it's either a, a team from Vietnam or a team of digital nomads from the US, UK, Canada that live in Vietnam. It's actually very interesting. I'm not really sure who runs this at all. I uh, will try to find out who runs this just to reach out, but it's a particularly very interesting store that they're doing multiple pages with just one or two ads, absolutely crushing it. And this one in particular, they just found one product that they're absolutely crushing it. That'll happen a lot with general stores. And again, like I said, this will happen most of the times with the general store. You find one store that works and then you'll scale it like crazy. That, that's, that is how you see people going from like 2,000 a month to like 200,000 a month. Like one of my students went from 8,000 to like 120,000 in just a, a span of two months. That is what happens. You find a winning product and then you scale that very, very strongly. We'll check out two more stores so you can see that this strategy actually works and that these stores are making a lot of money. I'm here doing one of my gratitude walks. I love just walking in the morning for like 10 minutes and thinking of the things that I'm grateful for. It's a really good exercise. If you don't really feel happy about who you are, if you don't feel like you're accomplished anything, just walking 10 minutes in nature or around your community, it doesn't have to be anything special. Just walk for 10 minutes and think, what are you grateful for? And the main things that you're grateful for in life, that you're happy, that you're healthy. And the, one of the main things that I'm grateful for is you, the people that watch my videos that contribute to my growth and my audience and teaching people out there how to build and start and grow a business. So I wanna thank you personally. You're one of the people that I thought of this morning in my gratitude walk here in my community. Thank you so much for being part of this. If you want to help grow the channel and help my channel out, make sure to subscribe. Subscribe, hit that red subscribe button, hit that notification bell because YouTube doesn't work like it used to before. It doesn't tell you about subscriptions. So make sure to click that subscription button, like the video if you liked it, and comment secrets down below for a free consulting call with me. Enjoy the video. This particular store right here, Sinabo Shop, it's also a very general store and they're selling this particular one. I found this ad running right here for this power joint, uh, power knee joint support or just a joint support, knee support. A lot of people are trying this product so I suggest you check out their ads. The key to advertising a saturated product, which is what not that many people talk about, is creative. If you focus on making the best video ever, the best creatives, testing multiple videos, multiple creatives, you will beat out a saturated product because people will be overwhelmed by how good the ad is. It'll perform a lot better. It'll perform in multiple audiences on Facebook. It'll just do better in total. So if you're trying to promote a product that might be saturated, don't really focus on targeting focus on your ads. If your ads are on point, it will sell a lot better than if they're not. It's not guaranteed to sell, but it will sell a lot better than if your creators are just meh and you do a lot of interest targeting. So let's go to actual sales source right here, or let me see if I can, I don't know why sales source is not pulling up on this one. Let me reload it and I'll go check out another store right here, analyze store, and we'll check out another general store in just a minute. And this one in particular is making sinaboshop.com. This one unknown is making 52,000 to 104. 
thousand dollars per month with a general store using the turbo theme which is a great theme that i recommend it is pretty expensive like 350 to 400 dollars we are using it for a new german store i am making a case study on that german untapped market store we're hoping to absolutely crush it get to that point of a hundred thousand a month or a million dollars in total revenue in an up untapped market so we'll see how that goes there are multiple collections right here so if you're thinking of and this this collection doesn't even have products that's insane and you can see that it's just a general traditional uh drop shipping store with a lot of collections selling many different products in many different categories another store that i want to show you is called deal stride and this one you've probably seen it they're running a lot of ads all over the us all over the uk pretty much to every e-packet country and again general dropshipping store multiple categories of products testing multiple products on facebook ads we'll go to their uh, sales source right here and analyze the store see how much they're actually making and they're making from two years ago they're making about 31,000 to 62,000 per month so it's not a huge huge store but it is still a general store that produces very very good results one tool that I want to show you if you find a store but you can't find their Facebook page you can't find where they're getting their traffic from and specifically what Facebook page they're driving the majority of the ads to that store and getting all those sales let's say you checked it out on sales source and it got a bunch of revenue or just making a lot of money very fast how do you find out where they're getting their traffic you use Pexglit. Pexglit is basically a winning products and spying tool. I don't have an affiliate link. I just use it myself and I recommend it to my students to search for a store right here. So let's say this particular Pasio shop, for example, and you check that Pasio shop that we just looked at. We put it right there and we click analyze now and you can see that on the top it will say and we'll, we'll load we'll let it load and see what pexel gives us you will see right here that the traffic by countries you can get that from there or similar web but the most important thing is the referring facebook traffic here you will get the facebook pages that are driving most or the majority of the traffic for this particular page so now you know okay this particular store is making a lot of money. Maybe you found their ad or maybe you just found the particular um, Facebook page for that one, but they don't have that many ads running in the ads library. This will tell you how many pages they have. For example, let's go to this gift of giving particular page. And now we're at the gift of giving particular page. The problem with searching for this page on the ads library, or let's say you're scrolling down Facebook and you're using the turbo ad finder. If you don't know what that is, an application that only shows you ads on your newsfeed. So let's scroll down on the ads and let's say you want to see the ads from this particular Mount trend page. Let's click on that and let's go to Mount trend. If you want to see the ads from that page, you can go to facebook.com slash ads slash library and actually type out, for example, Mount trend. But sometimes this particular brand shows up. What will happen sometimes is the page won't show up. It just won't show up. There's no page for it on the ads library or a lot of other weird pages will pop up. If we do the gift of giving, not that much, but the home in heaven is the one that doesn't show up. The one that I showed you before that was running some of their ads, the little grip thing. If you look for this particular page and we type in home and heaven right here, it doesn't show up, right? Other pages show up. So how do you actually find what ads they are running? What I found and what I came up with, I haven't seen anybody talk about it. I was just like looking at this page for like an hour trying to find ads. You can click on whatever page that is and just take the ID of the page from the end of the page. So you take this particular ID from the end and then you add it to the end of the URL of the Facebook ads library URL. Once you look for another page, you put that in there and it should show the ads, fingers crossed. And there we go, boom. It shows the ads for the other page. You change it to whatever country you're in. I'm in Ukraine right now, so you just put it to United States. Boom, and you found the ads right there. So you go on Pexla, you check for the particular shop. If it is whatever other shop, let's say this Mount Trend thing that was showing ads before. Let's go to another one just to check it out. This one in particular, Body Well Spring. We'll go to bodywellspring.com. We'll put it on Pexla see what it tells us and then see what exact pages are referring traffic from Facebook to this page this one only body well spring yeah this part this particular page is the only one that's showing let's see if it's showing up on the ads library so we'll type in body well spring and let's see if that works body well spring and this one in particular yeah it pops up 
and there's no ads running that it, that looks weird though because this was the exact page that we looked at let's hmm that's really weird that there's no ads running in the let me see Australia because there's people from Australia there there's no ads running weirdly but there we just found an ad in the ads uh, in the Facebook ad feed so that's kind of weird but that's the little trick to find it you take that ID from the end and then you pull it to the end of your ads library URL I haven't seen anybody try it and that is how you find pages that you might find the page but you can't find it in ads library a lot of people have been asking for this and I finally found it, it took me like two hours to figure out but I finally did it make sure to check that out and general stores that might not be showing the right pages or they have a lot of Facebook pages showing up you can go to Pexa, check them out and then go to the ads library that's it for general stores if you want to find out how my students make more than twenty thousand dollars profit every single month on Shopify dropshipping make sure to check out the video right there with the updated student strategy from my students my best best students Check out the video right there. Make sure to sign up for the waitlist in the first link in the description and schedule a call with me or my team in the second link in the description. Comment secrets down below, subscribe to the channel, hit that notification bell, like the video, and I will see you in the next one.